welcome back everyone, General Tony here, your host, coming back with a brand new episode and welcome my friends to Air Attacks Strike Back. We're about to do two live attacks attacking number one and number two on the opponent's team, both of which are actually Town Hall 11. Now we already have a plan, hopefully to three star number one, I am the man with a plan, and uh, fingers crossed it's gonna go well guys, then we will be attacking the number two player using two different air attacks so this is going to be featured you know just featuring pretty much air attacks in this episode as i said fingers crossed we can actually do this now i would just like to say guys we are almost at 1 million 250,000 subscribers and i would just like to say thank you for the constant support on the channel please do not forget we are doing a 1.3 million subscriber giveaway as soon as we reach 1.3 million subs we're going to give away $250 to my subscribers. So if you want the chance to win part of that, leave a like on the video is all you need to do and subscribe to the channel. Smash that like button, sub to the channel guys and stay tuned for 1.3 million subs. But for now, we're going to get ourselves into this first attack. Now I've actually decided to change it. We do have a double clone spell, but we're going to delete one of them. And we're actually going to go back into the spells. We're going to bring two extra haste spells. And we're going to bring, I'm going to try something which I've never really tried before. I'm going to try a double poison. If it doesn't work, I'm going to really be in a little bit of trouble. Or I could just leave the poisons and um, bring an extra haste spell and an extra, and one poison. Let's do that, guys. Let, let's try something a little bit dodgy. So I am hoping for a three star. If you've made it this far into the video, go down below in that comment section and comment hashtag good luck, Tony. We're going to be attacking number one first. Let's see how we do. So the plan is two loons in there, take out that actual, uh, that archer tower and draw out the defending clan castle. Going to chuck in the jump spell there with the heroes and the giants inside of my CC. And we're going to try and take out as many of these buildings plus those two defenses, or those two area defenses and of course the archer queen. And then we're going to go in with a large scale loon attack. So uh, let's just get it done and see what happens. Please remember if we do fail guys, um, I apologize, I completely suck. If I fail this and we don't even two star, you have my uh, my permission to dislike the video and say Tony you suck. So, I'm actually really nervous guys, so I'm going to try and draw out this clan castle using two balloons, but we're also trying to take out the archer tower. So uh, hopefully this works. I'm praying this actually works. Let's just do it, I mean we may as well just go ahead and you know, Give it a go. So one clone spell, six haste spells, it's quite a lot. Um, I don't know if it's going to work, but you know what? No time like the present. So we're actually going to try three loons on this uh, this little bomb tower. Hopefully they can draw out the entire clan castle. They haven't got anything. Okay, so I'm guessing the clan castle is actually all ground troops. So I'm guessing it's going to be a golem or something like that, which is actually cool. That's good for me. So what we're going to do... We're going to drop in these giants, the queen, and then we're going to go in with these wizards to make a nice little funnel. Then we're going to drop in the jump spell and, of course, the barbarian king. And uh, hoping that the barbarian king, we need him to go into the center. No, no, barbarian king hasn't gone into the center. This is going to go really bad for me really quickly if I don't do something here. We're going to have to try and distract this queen using some balloons but i think i sent them in too early guys this is pretty damn unfortunate for me here we go here we go queen's ability has just been used she's gonna take oh we just missed the barbarian king's ability as well okay as long as i can grab one of these air defenses it'll be okay one air defense oh my we're in so much trouble i'm in so much trouble here we go guys let's hope that we can grab you know what we're just gonna have to hope and see what happens here here we go this is gonna be so unfortunate at least we got loads of those air mines and air bombs out of the way. But now we just need to go in for this large scale attack, guys. Hopefully we can actually do this. Gonna send in some more up the top. And uh, there goes the Lava Hound. There goes the Grand Warden. To be honest with you, I don't really think this is gonna happen for me. But uh, let's see what actually goes down. So we're gonna drop in these haste spells. Let's do this, guys. Haste spells. There goes a clone spell directly into the center of the base. Going to put the Grand Warden's ability right now, trying to keep these balloons as live as long as we can. Airstrikes back, not looking really too good for me right now. There goes the final haste spell onto the Eagle Artillery. Town Hall's going to go down, so we got a 2-star. But I was really hoping, this is actually a really easy base to 3-star, but I did just completely mess up the attack strategy. There goes the final air defense. But I haven't actually kept any balloons back, guys. And uh, we need to take out as many of these defenses as quickly as we can. 
Air Sweeper somehow blew those balloons back when they weren't even in range. That was a little bit strange. So here we go, the final few buildings. Look at that, guys. I don't think we're going to be three-starring. Unfortunately, it looks like a single Archer Tower is going to be my downfall. So this is going to be... Is there two balloons or just one balloon? Here we go, the last balloon. Can we do it? That's maybe just going to grab it, guys. Here we go. There goes the final building. This is going to be so close. This is incredibly close. Way too close. 95%. 97% oh my god we've done it we have literally done it the closest three star I have ever had that was so damn lucky and there he goes my friends three star in the back the perfect attack strategy air strikes back and we picked up the triple that was actually so lucky so I'm actually uh, pretty damn surprised we managed the three star there considering the archer queen and the kill squad didn't really do anything at all so we're gonna try this base now guys now this base is actually a little bit different and uh, we're not actually going to be requesting the same clan castle. So this time we're going to do something different. So here we go. Going to go for a golem and a jump spell inside of the, uh, the clan castle. And that should hopefully be our kill squad and our spell to get us into the core to take out the queen, one air defense and the inferno tower. So golem and jump spell have actually been requested. Now it's time to actually build the air army, guys. So remember, air strikes back. I'm actually pretty damn, I don't know. That was pretty scary, I'm, I'm really not going to lie. So at least we know that there should be ground troops inside of this clan castle, which is great for me, because it actually means there's not really going to be a problem at all. So we've got an air defense over here. Actually, you know what, guys? We are going to... And we get a jump spell to go into the Inferno Tower and also across that wall there. I'm not sure if it's going to work. I'm hoping it's going to... Let's try it anyway. It'll work. It might It might work. It might not. Let's see what happens. So let's build our army. We're going to go with another. Let's see. Where are the air sweepers? Air sweeper 1 located. Air sweeper 2 located. Okay, this is going to be good, guys. We could potentially get the six-pack clan war. Let's see what happens. So we're going to go into the spells. We're going to brew ourselves two of these beautiful clone spells. And we're going to go for a triple haste spell once again. No poison spell this time. Because fingers crossed, it is going to be a ground clan castle. Then inside of the training of the troops, we're going to go with a lava hound. Just like we did before. 30 max balloons. And we're also going to bring ourselves, I think, what was it? 18 minions. That's going to take us to 18. And we're going to go 6 wizards once again. So literally the same army, except this time, we're going to be bringing a jump spell and a golem inside of the clan castle instead of the previous troops. So let's actually see what the attack is going to be. If I go into the scouting of the base here, guys, check this out. So, we have the initial kill squad is going to be Barbarian King, Golem, Archer Queen. That's hopefully going to allow me to take out as many of these buildings as we can. As I said, we're going to be dropping the jump spell roughly between the Wizard Tower, maybe just on the Wizard Tower. And hopefully it's going to allow me into the, um, the Inferno Tower. If it doesn't, it's not really too much of an issue. We then have the, uh, the Barbarian King and the Queen with the six wizards to make a little funnel there. And hopefully they're going to actually clear those buildings. And the Barbarian King can jump into the core this time. Take out the Archer Queen, hopefully. If the Archer Queen doesn't go down, it is definitely going to be a problem. And uh, hopefully that's going to be the kill squad. Then what we're going to do, we're actually going to go and target. We are going to target this side of the base right here. So we're going to make a little bit of a funnel here using a couple of balloons and a haste spell. And then we're going to basically send in all the rest of the balloons around this region. And hopefully we can use the clone spells appropriately and take out the base for a three star. If it doesn't work, uh, Tony sucks. So let's do it. So we've been waiting quite a few minutes, guys, and we haven't actually received anything inside of the clan castle when I just requested again. So we may have to divert from doing the second clan war attack and we may do a live attack instead using the same army guys i think that's what we're going to do we're going to go in for a little bit of a practice so let's do this if we receive the golem and the jump spell within the next couple of minutes we'll do the clan war attack if we don't then we're going to go in for a live attack instead inside a multiplayer battlefield so let's see if we can find a decent base and uh fingers crossed we can three star whatever it is so check this out, we've actually just literally landed on this uh, this Town Hall 11. Now obviously we don't have a jump spell, we don't have our golem. Let's see if we can 3 star it guys. 450,000 elixir, it's got a great amount of loot. The only problem is, we might not be able to get into the core. So let's see if it's actually going to be able to get in. So what we're going to do, we're going to drop down the Barbarian King, two wizards there. 
and the rest of the wizards there to make a nice little funnel. Hopefully they're going to uh, actually divert into the center. Here we go. King should go in towards the center. There goes the king's ability. He's going to take out that squirrel rule really quickly. Hopefully he can get a swing on the queen. Yes, he did. He actually took out the queen, so that's sweet. There goes the, uh, the cannon. Haven't managed to grab a single air defense yet, guys. There goes the queen's ability. She's going to take out the archer. There goes the gold storage, and it's made a little bit of a dent, but not really too much, to be honest with you. So uh, let's see if we can funnel into the center. So what we're going to do, we're going to start this off by... The air sweepers are actually in a little bit of an awkward position. So we're going to try something a little bit different, guys. We are going to take out these buildings at the top first using just a couple of archers. Sorry, a couple of balloons to take out these buildings up the top. Hopefully they're going to fall. We haven't used a single haste spell, so I'm hoping this is going to work. Here we go. Wizard Tower should go down as well. Should grab the Wizard Tower. Here we go, guys. And as soon as the Wizard Tower goes down, there it goes. We can actually go in for our attack on the rest of the base. Let's see what happens. So, we're going to do this by funneling in these balloons like that. Most of them going to go up towards the top. There goes the Grand Warden. There goes the Lava Hound. And now here go the minions just behind. And uh, we're going to pop the Grand Warden's ability really early, making sure as many of these balloons actually survive. There goes the first clone spell. There goes a double haste spell. Oh no, we got dragons. There's a dragon inside of the uh, defending clan cast. We actually cloned the Lava Hound. That's not really a good thing, guys. Here we go. Second clone spell going to go down into the core. There goes the final haste spell. Going to take out the Eagle Artillery pretty quick. We should, get a, we should get at least a two-star on the base, guys, and grab the majority of the loot. The only problem is we didn't have a jump spell, of course, at the start, and that's going to make us, you know, suffer a little bit here. Actually, I don't even know if we're going to grab the Town Hall. Let's see what happens. This is going to be close. Minions are actually going to swing in on the Town Hall right now. No, they're not. Wow. So it looks like we walked away with a perfect one star and check that out guys, we just received our golem and our jump spell, but we're going to end this episode here guys, we are going to come back to see what happens when we do the second live attack, leave a like on the video, sub to the channel, peace out.